Yellow! Let's go, baby. Nice one, too. Candy bar yo-yo. Let's go. Great to see you guys. Already got some yellow tail too? Nice, on the vertical jig? You still you still catching them now? You gonna fish here? Oh, there it is, yeah, yeah. Nice. I know, he's the legend. There it is. Yeah. You guys are slayers. <laughs> you got two already? Yeah. And then you got. What happened in the other one? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm gonna get my yo yo. I'm gonna start uh, yo yo iron. All right, they said slow. They're, they're slow pitching with some SK jigs. So we're gonna go ahead and go with the uh, heavy yo-yo. Hook up! You want one? I thought it was stonefish. <laughs> Head shakes. Yeah! Woo Hunter's on it. For the grouper? Yeah. That's the grouper bait? Yeah. Hold, you cut it up or you set it down uh, alive? Yeah. Uh, alive? Yeah. For the grouper? Yeah. <laughs> I want to see you guys get that grouper. Yeah, yeah, that's perfect grouper bait. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're gonna move spots? Okay. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Hunter hooked up on that yellow tail. They put that down on the bottom. He's hooked up. Bando, full bando. Come on, Hunter! Get him! Yeah! It didn't break, it, it let go of it. I don't know what happened, we'll see. There's a lot of fish under us. What'd you get back, the yellowtail? Yeah. So he let go of it? Oh, he missed the treble hook. Dang. Yeah, put it back down. Put, send it back down. Okay. Man, they just hooked up on a yellowtail on the bottom. Grouper Hunter had him for, but he didn't hit the the uh, trap hook, the, the treble.
hell is this thing? Weird ass fish. You think it's called a stonefish? Yeah, right. <laughs> Crazy. Look at that thing. It says it walks with those pectoral fins. Frog? Yeah, that's what I thought. It almost has that look to it. Could be a frog. Frog fish. Either way, it's crazy. He's going back. guys are the best. Look at how the fresh, fresh made sandwich, all the water from Antonio, the man. Ham and cheese? Ham and cheese, lettuce and tomatoes. Yeah. Best delivery ever had. Drive through. Drive through. Yeah, that's where it's at. You guys are awesome. Thank you. Get that grouper. I will. Yep. Man, that's what I'm talking about. You even got the tomatoes and lettuce, turkey, cheese, or ham and cheese. Man, that's good stuff. Thank you, Antonio. It's 11 o'clock now. We're gonna move spots because the flat dead tide. We're gonna go fish some rosy cheek whitefish, some other crazy split tail bass, orange bass, or something like that. I don't know. Juan is telling me all about this stuff. It's really, really cool, so. We're gonna move spots. Where are these other commercial guys, these conga boats are fishing. They live in holes in the clay on the bottom in the mud. So stoked to be able to get some new fish species and I was stoked to get that yellowtail there at the Golden Reef. Lost my candy bar though. Go back to the Taddy Yo Yo. 300 foot bottom. fish the golden reef on the way back after the tide starts moving so hunter can get redemption on his his grouper he hooked up twice first time he had it for a while he's battling it then it let go and never hit the treble trap hook put a whole yellowtail small yellowtail down there on a trap rig giant circle hook on the front j hook with a giant trap hook a treble hook on the back 200 pound main line with 400 pound leader. Avid 50 wide. That's his, that's his setup for the grouper here. He got a 130 pounder that way. Man, this is awesome. What's it called? Wow. Yeah. Nice, Jay. Yeah, doing that little slow pitch all, all the way on the bottom. Yeah. Right on the bottom. Fishing. Yeah, <laughs> got the milk, and then what was this one? That's that. Coca. Yeah. 250 gram. From uh, Pro Hunter. There we go. Getting hooked up with the jigs. Slow pitch jigs. Check out Pro Hunter. Got it. Juan wants the man. <laughs> Got one. Got one? Yeah, I don't know what it is on that coca jig. So far down, it just takes a while to get back up. 400, 400 yeah. Here we go. Looks like a calico, but it's. In, is that a Cabrillo, right? No. Yeah, that's a... Yeah, I know. Yeah, I got the Cabrillo. Yeah, with those yellow spots like that. On that Coca. Juan hooked it up with Coca jigs. I thought Cabrillo were up by the rocks. Yeah, they're, the they're everywhere, huh? The beautiful Cabrillo, there it is. 
That one was on, you had a little piece of bait on yours? Yeah. Wait. Beauty. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it is. Nice job. A whole squid? Circle hook. Oh, just a circle hook, just a drop shot. Yeah. Oh, double. Yeah, there you go. I see, I thought Cabrillo we were by the rocks too, but we're in the sand right now. But hey, I'll take it all day. Nice job. Why not? Exactly. Up oh, from the deeps. What do you got? Another Cabrillo? Another one. Oh, it's a white fish. Oh, that's that rosy white fish he was talking about. Blanco. White that's the white fish, but look, that yeah, it's different than the Pacific white fish. They call it, they call it watcho. Watcho? Good eating. Yeah, they are. I'll show it to you. Nice. Man, I'm hunches on fire. That's right. <laughs> I think it's eel. I guess I got an eel. Or some. Look at that. Next up, crazy ass eel or something. He hit that coca jig. All right, we're going back to the rock area. Stoked on that Cabrilla. I don't know what was going on with that eel. Hunter killed it. You got two of those rosy white fish. That orange calico split tail. Crazy how glassy it is. It looks like the sky. That's what Juan was just saying. All right, we're going back to the rocks. See if they can get that grouper. See if I get some more yellowtail. I'm stoked though, yellowtail and Cabrilla. And they're getting bait from the commercial guys. Jeez. You guys are killing it. That's all in the hand line too. All those yeah. guys got that all in the hand line? Yeah. That's a cool spot. This is a, wow. a merluza or a Pacific cake. Okay, yeah. And this is a type of uh, file fish. I don't know what kind. But, uh, we just caught these guys. Uh, these, <laughs> are, these are really, really good eating. Jeez. Hey, wow. Hey. That's awesome. Local knowledge. All right, come on, man. <laughs> yeah, hey, get all. Yeah, local knowledge here on the Sea of Cortez. Local guys just killing it. They caught those all in the irons. What do they use to catch those? Hey, I think they are the line. They have a big line. Hooks and bait on the hand line. Savage. Yeah, you guys are awesome. So all those lines right there. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Savages. <laughs> that was awesome. I got to see some of these rare species that these guys are just savages hand lining all those fish. Crazy stuff. All right, we're going back Golden Reef. See if we can get make happen here at the end of the day, the second half of the day. Get my something, squid on that lure. Korea. Another Cabrillo. Yep, Cabrillo. Another Cabrillo on that Coca 250, Just crushing it. <laughs> Captain Juan was talking about how good they are tasting. All right, Juan hooked me up with the jig and got a little small Cabrillo. Okay, back at the Golden Reef, Antonio hooked one on the iron. Lock, watch, you gotta hurry up. The seal's coming now. He's a virgin. He's a virgin. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Breaking him in. Nice! Look at that! Beefy yellowtail! <laughs> 
Antonio. <laughs> That's a nice one. Look at that. Huge, man. Yeah, Antonio. Yeah. There it is. Beauty. Good job. Yeah! <laughs> That's your first yellowtail? Yeah! Wow! Biggest one of the day, huh? I know! It's that hard for Antonio to eat. <laughs> That's a hell of a first yellowtail. <laughs> still beating, huh? Yeah, it is still beating. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's still beating. <laughs> Oh. Cerveza to wash it down. <laughs> yeah. Bienvenido a Cruz. <laughs> True fisherman right there. Hey, right, that's it. That's all for out the golden reef with Captain Juan, Antonio, Hunter, and Mario. Stoked! I got the yellowtail. Got some cabria. Back at it tomorrow. Thank you all for watching. Down to Gonzaga Bay, Puerto Cito. Mario, Mario Antonio, and Hunter. All right, so there you have it. Go down to Punta Bufeo. So hard. Buddy Mikey here, SD Fishing Sips, Road Warrior, back on the road, on the way to Baja, going down to Gonzaga Bay, Puerto Cito. Rolling through Calexico, border town here, top off on gas. Oh yeah! Ready to do this or what? Hey man, how are you? Mikey. I know, I saw yeah, you. Right on, I appreciate it. What's your name? Antonio. Anto we got Antonio. Antonio. Hunter Dago. Oh, Hunter. Antonio and Mario. And Mario. Mario, yes. Mario, 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 Mario Antonio, Antonio and Hunter. Yes. Mario we got the Andretti. <laughs> like the race car driver. <laughs> I, saw, I, saw, I saw this. We're going to fish with Cook. That's, I was just reading about it. I saw that 130 pound grouper that he got last year. Are you you're gonna, record. Are you gonna go to Golden Reef with Juan? Yes, that's right. That's the legendary <laughs> spot. That's what I was looking up. Okay guys, put, put on here, the picture for the... Yeah. yeah. <laughs> with the Mari, Mari Mari? Yeah, yeah. I gotta get you guys some stickers. Yeah. You want some stickers? Of course. Sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go, show time. Next stop, Baja. Met the crew here. We got Antonio, Hunter, Mario. We're gonna be trolling hard. Let's get it. Maybe get out to Golden Reef. In a quarter mile, turn left onto Calzada de los Presidentes. Sand here by San Felipe. We're coming, getting closer. Coming almost into San Felipe. Salt flats here, coming out of the mountains. Then got the rock up there in the distance of San Felipe. Making our way, it's about high, it's high noon right now. More than halfway there. Picked up support group to go down there with. Stoked on that, I met Antonio, Mario, and Hunter there. There when I was driving right before I crossed the border, a truck swoops by me and they, they're, shining their camera tell me they watch all the videos i love it thank you everybody for the love and support uh with watching the videos follow along with the journeys and the dreams and the experiences and then get to do it together that's what they they checked on me i stopped on the side of the road to use the bathroom 
grab a little bite to eat, some water, and they, they're pulling up behind me, making sure everything's good, everything's okay. So I got my support group, it's awesome. And they're fishing with Juan Cook, who's a legend of the area down in Baja. He got a 130 pound Gulf grouper last year. So we have a support group. If I go make it all the way out to Golden Reef, I'm stoked on that. It's just, this is gonna be an awesome trip. I'm stoked. We're gonna have today, get in there probably hopefully launch between three and four fish the evening time and then fish all day tomorrow with them golden reef in the islands uh, monday and tuesday and then head back wednesday see what we can make happen yellowtail sierra cabrilla maybe some grouper maybe some halibut maybe some white sea bass you never really know it's a magical place down here in baja so if you haven't already smash that subscribe pound that like Join channel memberships, check out my Amazon storefront, all different ways to support. We're coming through some more of the mountain ranges before we get to San Felipe. I'm gonna keep, keep going, keep driving. Such a beautiful drive, such a beautiful area. Baja is a special place. There it is, the marina, San Felipe Marina. Marina. There's a boat out there, there's some boiler rocks. Somebody fishing. 211 right now. Just cruising, beautiful Sunday. Kind of some alone time. Yeah, Puertocitos right here. There's the harbor, the little launch spot. There's the hot springs at the end. Getting closer, almost there, probably another half hour. There's the islands. Encantadas Islands, the Enchanted Islands. Golden Reef is out there too. It's looking flat and glassy and nice, wow. Just empty down here in Baja, I love it so much. Especially all the good people. That's what really makes it. Look at how glassy. Wow, glassy and nice. Woo -hoo -hoo. Let's go. There's a shrimp boat, gill netter or something. There's the money islands in the distance. Getting close to the turnoff. There's the island, there's some of the houses. They have Campo Encantadas and Campo Paloma. I don't think I missed it yet. Okay, here is Encantadas. Las Encantadas. But I'm gonna go to the next one here to La Paloma. It's a little bit more developed. They have a place to stay here. Let's check it out. Got somebody up on the sign. La Poma. Camping sport fishing let's get it we made it next stop is it we got Punta Buffet over here that's where I'm gonna fish tonight and then tomorrow I'll go to the island and Golden Reef yes so stoked let's go Baja baby spring time 2023 Baja Baja cruising. <laughs> Here's the spot, La Poma. They got the cool palm fronds, the rooster fish, snapper, white sea bass. There's the rig. Get down on these shrimp tacos before I go out fishing but in my little setup i got my table parking spot lawn ramp right there a little grill i can barbecue it up let's go so what we're looking at i'm right here by Encantadas. we're looking at the big island straight out here so we're gonna go to the back side no but tonight that's tomorrow and then maybe out to the golden reef Got with my buddies that I met on the way. But today we're going to Punta Buffeo and then we'll cruise down here towards Papa Fernandez. Hit those spots up. 
Let's get let's get going. Get a time lapse. Shot setting up. Made it. Baja. 2023 spring. Let's get it. fish finder on when we get out there don't even know if I'll really need it today but I got the bait casters the Trank 300 on the M1 inshore with the with the mad skag right now got the pen squall on the Daiwa Proteus with the plastic then I got the x wrap and the yo-yo so I'm gonna go first thing I'm gonna do is go troll the x wrap and then I'll be casting at the rocks down by the point. So stoked. Okay. Flip that down, get the trollers ready. I got it on the Avid SX lever drag. X Wrap 20 with some new hooks. Start trolling. Okay. This guy's fishing. Four to five miles an hour probably. Got the yo-yo iron a jig too. And that plastic. I could put a cold sniper on. There is Gonzaga Bay all the way in the distance. Flat fall. That has to be fish. Look at that. Cold sniper or mega bait.
maybe they want the iron surface iron put on a smaller troller no bites yet come on troll hard Try the X-Rap 15. Since the 20 wasn't getting bit. White 15 versus the green. Back mackerel 20. See? like something's going on some bait at least and these little birds let's see what shows up on the fish finder there's blank right now there's a lot of little birds right here larger marks a small bait looks like we're coming to the end of punta bufeo here got uh papa fernandez fish camp up just a little bit and then gonzaga bay over there, Punta Final. Flash the card for my other video when I stayed at Papa Fernandez with Bill when I went down to Mag Bay. So I'm gonna I'm gonna turn and troll back. I got the X Wrap 20 back on here. Dirty water. I gotta check it out to this. Come on, let's get hooked. One fish. Well, by the birds again, I guess. Smaller uh, Cole Sniper style. I think this is the Daiwa. The Kima or whatever. Sun's going down, running out of time. Come on, I want one fish. Drop the little small Colt sniper down. There you go. What we got trigger. I'll take it. Got one. Too small. Well, I know a jig's working. It's a little small. Trigger fish time, trigger fish to each eh? Harder fighter. Nice. What are we 
Look at that. It's a beauty. We'll release that back. Little school something here. Let's go. We're slamming it. Bring this in. My first evening here. Back, back. Camp. Rest up for tonight. Got five trigger fish. Release the spotted bay bass and another fish. So thank you all for watching. Day one here in Baja Dreaming. Tomorrow, Golden Reef, hopefully. Living the dream. And then we'll be going out to the island, backside, maybe up to Golden Reef. It's looking like a beautiful day today. So good morning, good morning, good morning, your buddy Mikey here. SC Fishing says Monday, March 13th, 2023. We're down here in the Sea of Cortez, Baja, with the solo skiff. This is the dream, I love it. Down here, time to get fishing. Got my grinding jacket, my gauge pants. Some booties, my life vest. These guys are smashing. Probably just made bait or they set their traps. Yeah, there we go. Hunter, this is Mike. Pick me up. Oh, I hit Mike. Look at that. First of all, good I'm, I'm just getting into the water right now. I got all my gear from uh, Incantadas and I was gonna head out to uh, the back side of the island, San Luis, or are you guys going up to Golden Reef? That's right, we're heading to the Golden Reef right now. Uh, if you wanna come, we can keep an eye on you. So this is your chance. Uh, so let us know what you're gonna do. I'm gonna make my way up to Golden Reef. I will see you up there. Alright, so you're gonna go down to channel 08. I repeat, 08. 10-4, I'm dropping down to channel 08 right now. Got it. Alright, we'll stay in touch. Sounds good, thank you, Hunter. Golden Reef, baby! We're going Golden Reef! That's a legendary, and then maybe they can give me some bait. They'll probably have bait on their boat, you know? Yeah. I got my dropper, but I didn't bring my big, uh, that that same bluefin setup is for the uh, grouper, those big grouper too. You have big giant, you know, 100 pound test, 150 pound test, you just button the drag down and crank on that thing.
Last night was uh, got like five or six trigger fish, uh, spotty, and then uh, I don't know what other type of fish it was. people everywhere I go. That was Bruno right there. Bruno's telling me stories about Ensenada tuna last year. I was telling him stories about the tuna I got. Then I get a hit up by Hunter on the radio. There with Juan Cook heading out to Golden Reef. That's where I'm going. zone but all I'm seeing is commercial boats I'm gonna go ahead and throw on the fish finder and then hit up to hunter on the radio hunter pick me up it's Mikey you got me. hunter it's Mike I just got out by Golden Reef I uh, just see the commercial guys out here looking for you might be that Mike, this is Hunter. Yeah, we don't see you here at the Golden Reef. You're not, you're not here yet. We are at the beginning of the, you know, the journey of the, of the reef. 
so we haven't seen them yet. I see three commercial pongas that are setting buoys for something. So you're here, we're gonna make a movie out of you. Yeah, and I gotta get you guys in my movie too, so that you can be in it. We're all in this together, getting fish. We'll be here. I think I can see you out there. I don't know if that's you or not, but head this way. Yeah, I'm coming to you. All right, stand by. Dang, they already got yellowtail. There they are up here. Just got commercial guys here, so I didn't get quite far enough. Got another three miles to go. Rolling up, here they are. We're getting to the shallower spot, 260, to crew fishing. On the Parker with Juan Cook, the legend. <laughs> Yeah. This is it, the dream. Yeah. Great to see you guys. Already got some yellowtail too. Nice on the vertical jig. You still you still catching them now? You gonna fish here? Oh, there it is! Yeah, yeah. Nice. I know he's the legend. There it is. Yeah. These guys are slayers. <laughs> you got two already? And I then you got. The what happened to the other one? He didn't go. Got it yet. Oh. <laughs> yeah, so you follow us to me. Right here is a good spot. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna get my yo yo. I'm gonna start uh, yo yo iron. Alright, All right. they said slow. They're, they're slow pitching with some SK jigs. But we're gonna go ahead and go with the uh, heavy yo yo. Candy bar. Hook up! You want one? I thought it was stonefish. <laughs> Head shakes? Yeah! Woo -hoo -hoo. Hunter's on it. We're gonna use that for, for a bait. For the grouper? Yeah. That's the grouper bait? Yeah. Hold, you cut it up or you set it down uh, alive? Yeah. Uh, alive? Yeah. Alive. alive? For the grouper? Oh yeah, yeah. we should try that. <laughs> I yeah, wanna see you guys one. get that grouper. Take it over, it's chance for a big one. Yeah, yeah, that's perfect grouper bait. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah. <laughs> You're gonna move spots? No, no, right here. Okay. Follow up. Yeah. Right, we're gonna yeah. Start with the yep. Okay. We're gonna put that little one down for the grouper. What the hell is this thing? Weird ass fish. Crazy. Look at that thing. It says it walks with those pectoral fish. Yeah, it's got the little like unicorn coming off the front of it. Yeah, I've never saw one like that. I've been fishing here for a while. I've never seen one. I used to see them on video. Yeah. Can I help you? Thank you. 
frog? Yeah, that's what I thought. It almost has that look to it. Could be a frog, frog fish. Either way, it's crazy He's going back. Yellow! Let's go, baby. Nice one, too. here at the Golden Reef. I got the yo-yo iron yellow on the candy bar. That blue and white, the mackerel pattern. I'm gonna go ahead and get it gutted in the ice bag. Still beating yellow tail heart. Take a bite out of it. Or eat the whole thing. Got frozen water bottles. I'm gonna stick that in his belly. All right, we're at 958. Got that one yellow tail and the angler fish, frog fish, whatever you want to call it. I'm stoked. I already got the yellow tail bled out. Water bottle in his belly on ice. We're gonna go look for some more. Following Juan, he's hooking it up. Hunter hooked up on that yellow tail. They put that down on the bottom. He's hooked up. Bando, full bando. Come on, Hunter! Get him! Yeah! It didn't break it, it let go of it. There's a lot of fish under us. What'd you get back? The yellowtail? Yeah. So he let go of it?
Oh, he missed the treble hook. Just barely, man. Dang. Put yeah, put it back down. Put, send it back down. Okay. Man, they just hooked up on a yellowtail on the bottom. Grouper Hunter had him for, but he didn't hit the the uh, trap hook, the, the treble. You gonna send it back down? Good area. These guys are the best. Look at how the fresh, fresh made sandwich, all the water from Antonio, the man. Ham and cheese? Ham and cheese, lettuce and tomatoes. And lots of chili. Yeah. Best delivery ever, man. Drive through. Drive through. Yeah, that's where it's at. You guys are awesome. Enjoy. Thank you. Get that grouper. I will. Yep. Man, that's what I'm talking about. You even got the tomatoes and lettuce. They're ham and cheese. Man, that's good stuff. Thank you, Antonio. Get this off the bottom. I'm just gonna break it. <clears throat> Got caught on the bottom. At least I didn't break off. It just pulled the lure out of my clip. It's 11 o'clock now. We're gonna move spots because the flat dead tide. We're gonna go fish some rosy cheek white fish, some other crazy split tail bass, orange bass, or something like that. I don't know. Juan is telling me all about this stuff. It's really, really cool. So. We're gonna move spots. Where are these other commercial guys, these conga boats are fishing. They live in holes in the clay on the bottom in the mud. So stoked to be able to get some new fish species and I was stoked to get that yellow tail there at the Golden Reef. Lost my candy bar though. Go back to the Taddy Yo-Yo. 300 foot bottom. come back and fish the golden reef on the way back after the tide starts moving so hunter can get redemption on his his grouper he hooked up twice first time he had it for a while he's battling it then it let go and never hit the treble trap hook put a whole yellow tail small yellow tail down there on a trap rig giant circle hook on the front j hook with the giant trap hook uh, treble hook on the back 200 pound main line with 400 pound leader. Avid 50 wide. That's a, that's a setup for the grouper here. He got a 130 pounder that way. Man, this is awesome. What's it called? Wow. Yeah. Nice, Jay. Yeah, doing that little slow pitch all, all the way on the bottom. Yeah. Right on the bottom. Fishing. <laughs> you got the milk, and then what was this one? That's that. Coca? Yeah. From, 250 gram? From uh, Pro Hunter. Is that an online store? Or is that a yeah. company? Online. Pro Hunter? We have it here. Cuda Killer. Cuda Killer? I have not. No. Yeah. Oh, okay. Nice. Thank you very much. I'll get these back to you at the end. Okay, keep it, man. Check out Pro I will. Thank yeah, you very much. Yep. Here we go, getting hooked up with the jigs. Slow pitch jigs. Check out Pro Hunter. <laughs> Got it, Juan. Juan's the man. <laughs> Got one. Yeah, I don't know what it is on that coca jig. So far down, it just takes a while to get back up. 400, yeah. Here we go. Looks like a calico, but it's. Is that a Cabrillo, right? Yeah, that's a... Yeah, I know. Yeah, I got the Cabrillo. Yeah, with those yellow spots like that. On that Coca. One hooked it up with Coca jigs. I thought Cabrillo were up by the rocks. 
They're everywhere, huh? Here we go. What do you like to do? Fry it up? Fry the cabrilla? Or how do you like to eat it? Barbecue? Ce ceviche, fish tacos, barbecue, anything, huh? Okay. No, it's going to my bag. It's going to my bag. Okay, next up, I got the cabrilla here. Slow pitching that coca. Kind of flat fall style lure that Juan hooked me up with. Let's go ahead and put this guy on ice. Great eating fish. Got the yellowtail and the cabrilla now. Staples of Baja here. See a Cortez. All right, let's go fish. Hunter's on it again. The beautiful Cabrillo, there it is. That one was on, you had a little piece of bait on yours? Yeah. Wait. Beauty. Oh yeah. <laughs> it is. Nice job. A whole squid? Yeah. Oh, double. Yeah, there you go. Up from the deeps. What do you got? Another Cabrillo? Another one. Oh, it's a white Oh, that's that rosy white fish he was talking about. Blanco. That's the white fish, but look, that, yeah, it's different than the Pacific white fish. They call it, they call it Wacho. Wacho? Good eating. Yeah, they are. I'll show it to you. Nice. Man, I'm on fire. That's right. <laughs> I think it's eel. I got, I got an eel. There's some. Look at that. Next up, crazy ass eel or something. Get that coca jig. Alright, we're going back to the rock area. Stoked on that Cabrilla. I don't know what was going on with that eel. Hunter killed it. You got two of those rosy white fish. That orange calico split tail. And they're getting bait from the commercial guys. <laughs> Tongue fish. That's another rare one. Looks like an eel almost with the tail. Wow. Hello. Say hi to you two, you're YouTube famous. Check <laughs> a bile fish. Bile. Oh, bile. Bile. Jeez. Merluza. You guys are killing it. That's all in the hand line, too. All those yeah. guys got that all in the hand line? Yeah. That's a cool spot. This is a, wow. a Merluza or a Pacific cake. Okay, yeah. And this is a type of uh, file fish. I don't know what kind. But, uh, we just got these guys. Uh, these, are, <laughs> these are really, really good eating. Jeez. Hey, wow. That's awesome. Local All right, come on, man. <laughs> yeah, hey, get all. Knowledge. Yeah, local knowledge here on the Sea of Cortez. Local yeah, guys just killing my, it. My, my, my. What do they use to catch those? Hey, I think they are as well. Is that line? They have a big line. Hooks and bait yeah. on the hand line. Yeah. Savage. Yeah, you guys are awesome. So all those lines right there? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Savages. Oh, <laughs> That was awesome. I got to see some of these rare species that these guys are just savages handlining all those fish. Crazy stuff. All right, we're going back Golden Reef. See if we can get, make happen here at the end of the day, the second half of the day. Okay, back at the Golden Reef, Antonio hook one on the iron. Hawk, watch, you gotta hurry up. The seal's coming now. Okay, good, he went to the front. 
Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Breaking him in. Only on pitching. <laughs> Yeah, I know. It looks like a nice one, too. Was it right on the bottom or uh, halfway up? Right on the bottom? Nice! Look at that! Baby Yellowtail! Antonio! <laughs> That's a nice one! Look at that! huge, man! Yeah, Antonio! Antonio. Yeah! There it is! Beauty! Good job! Yeah! That's your first yellowtail? Yeah! Wow! That away! Biggest one of the day, huh? I know! It's that hard for Antonio to eat! <laughs> That's a hell of a first yellowtail! <laughs> still, <laughs> yeah, it is still beating, huh? Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's still beating. Gloria se está moviendo. Y va para adentro, Antonio. Para adentro, sí. Todo? Sí, todo. Muérdenos, muérdenos. Otra vez, otra vez, otra vez. Cerveza to wash it down. Yeah. Bienvenido a Cruz. All right, that's it, that's all for out the Golden Wraith with Captain Juan, Antonio, Hunter, and Mario. I got the yellowtail, got some cabria, and I released back that, that angler fish or rock fish, I mean uh, angler fish, frog fish, whatever it was. Crazy. Be back at it tomorrow. Thank you all for watching. Well, I'm gonna still fish the the big island. At the end of the day here. Do some trolling, some jigging around it, see if we can nab a couple more. 3.30 right now. I got till 6.30 or 7. Alright, 4.45 and we're almost back at the big island, San Luis. Stayed here. And troll a little small island off the big one because back in the day, 2016, Got a bunch of yellowtail trolling Rapalas out there, so I got the Rapala still on. From last night, do a little jigging also. Cold snipers and uh, stick baits. Maybe yo yo. Bunch of marks on the bottom. Alright, see if we can get one on the troll. Man, how cool is that? This island got some caves in it. It's getting shallow. What's going on with these birds? Some troll hard, let's hook up. Come on now. But that's it, that's all. It's, uh, yeah, 5.15. Might fish the boiler rocks a little bit, but I'm pretty much done for the day. Get these fish in the brine. A lot of birds. What's going on under them? Crazy volcanic rock style. There's camp.
back at camp. Let's get these fish in the brine. Tuesday, March 14th, 2023. I'm going to bring an extra gallon today just in case. If I have enough. Alright, full gas. Extra a little bit. Got the commercial guys going out. Set up. We got fish finder battery, rods, reels, and lures. Water, get those down there and then up to their open. I might get a coffee at the restaurant. I gotta get my ice too. We built out of scratch. Oh, and he's got his Hobie there too. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. These are all, and look, he's even got the setup. This is for the wheels. You have the sand, the wheels on it too. Yeah. And then, does he have it, uh... Yeah, look at it. He's even got it plumb with the live well, this one. Okay. Oh, and I think he's even got the, the switch to turn the live well on. And then this is this is what I need right here. Yeah, I saw that. I saw that. That one I saw I saw when there was a pile of uh, lumber in the back of Bob's truck. This, this transom, uh... Oh, supporter cool. i need one of those okay because my thing's bending back mm -hmm. yeah um i think what he did with this i think you have to have it sit higher the motor you you have to have an extension i think that this is actually an extension oh. and it comes up higher because that's what bob said to put does he have an eight horsepower honda uh -huh. no that's somebody else's He's got those on the side, but because he said it, uh, eight uh, eight Honda that yeah, if Bob you wanted to do a big trip on that one, that's why he he built that one. I tell you, I saw that a, a pile of lumber behind his truck when he brought it in. It was a pile of lumber, brand new lumber. He built it complete wow. out of scratch. When and he went after he didn't have no legs. <laughs> After he built, he lost his legs, he built Yeah, this was the the cart that I saw him roll up on. This is what he used to no, drive. No, no, he had another one. He had oh, a, this he, wasn't he, his? He, it's back here somewhere. It's a little, uh, it's a, it's a rhino. Rhino. Yeah. yeah, see, and then that's the, what he had right here for the uh, fish finder, for the transducer on the fish finder. Okay, you drop it through there. No, the wire has come out, and then you can have it mounted. You see the screws right here? That's how I have mine mounted on the back right here. And then it comes through here. This might be something else. No, this is... You think these were Bob's? Yeah, Bob had two. Okay. I never saw him on those. Showtime. Took a little while, but did it. Talking with Augie, checking out the solo skiff. Like a lake, like a pool today. Even glossier than yesterday. Alright, next stop. Golden Reed, two hours.
started Should I know? We have a hot, hot dog in the menu today. Oh, yeah. you guys are the best. <laughs> Two so far on the on the knife jigs. Yeah, the, the jigs are fun and the killer. Oh yeah, oh Antonio's got his too. Yeah. You each got one. Change the paper, you know, the different now. Fun and the killer. Yeah, he is. He's the legend. <laughs> we have another one. So four. Five. You got four already? Oh, who got the uh, wait? So. Oh, so that, that's what you're saying Juan's the Slayer. Yeah, he didn't Bobby just put you on the spot. He yeah. hooked them all, too. <laughs> on the, on the... Right? Yeah. The orange one, that's the ticket? Yeah, that's the ticket. But it's, it's just pulling it up and down right off along the bottom. But, but you're coming up through the water all the way. Lift, reel, lift. Got it. No, I'm good, I'm good, thank you. <laughs> it is a frog fish, huh? Yeah. Yeah. It was an eel. That's what I thought the the tail looked like an eel tail. Yeah, you you took it home. You're gonna eat that, right? <laughs> yeah, good for you. All right, let's get on them. What time's lunch? <laughs> you got the grill and everything, or what? Yeah, <laughs> man. Yeah. All right. A little morning report. There you have five yellowtail. One hook four. All in those knife style jigs. Slow pitching. Lift reel. Lift reel. Get one down in Los Barriles? Yeah, I have a friend of mine down there. That's a lot of people. Yeah, if he, if he fits off the kayak, that's what helps. If you start on the kayak, then you go to this, you know? Is there Pargo down here too, or mostly Cabrilla? Pargo summertime? You don't, are you not going for the group? You don't have anything to use for the grouper? Oh, a white wife? Yeah. That's good for right now. Okay. Put just a little piece. Yeah, that's what I do. I'm 
I'm gonna do it on that flat ball lure with the two hooks. Just a little piece on it. We like the drop shot, double dropper loop, huh? Fish and sit right here on the side. Yeah. <laughs> I got six horsepower Mercury. Yes, yeah, the solo skiff is the name of the boat. It's a uh, Suzuki or Yamaha? Yamaha? Double Cabrilla, killer. Size. What's that? A frogfish? Yeah, and he got back down too. I had to go back and try to push him, and then finally, after I pushed him, he got back down to the bottom. Yeah. Mario's got one? Challenge down on the mango. Yep. And there it is. That's your grouper bait. That's how. There we go. Oh, that's why you're fishing the bottom to get the grouper bait. Good idea. The hunter put down a whole white fish, one of those rosy white fish, with a grouper. He's gonna get redemption. I'm a lucky rod and reel, huh? <laughs> I know I had some I had a sandwich yesterday. I'm looking forward to the ceviche today. Yellowtail. Yellowtail ceviche? Yeah. yeah. What do you do you mix anything else with it? Or just the fish and, and lemon? Or I mean lime. Oh yeah, you just buy the pico and then mix it together? Or do you ch you chop it all yourself? So tomato and onion and cilantro. Tap tapatillo? And then put it on a tostada. Yeah, right on. Ceviche time on the water. Got the sandwich yesterday. They're fishing for grouper. Lunch time, Chef Mario. On the water ceviche, yellowtail ceviche, doing it right. You got something to Look at this spray Mario's doing on the water. <laughs> Man, that's your little, uh... Like sashimi. This is tiritas de jurel. Tiras de jurel. Jurel in Spanish is like the yellow tail. Yeah, mm. jurel. Yeah, that's the bomb. Wow. Mm -hmm. The 
caught today. Yeah. Yeah, I chopped it off. Yeah. Yeah, we chopped it off. Super fresh. I don't know. Uh, I don't know if you want to take off, and you know, we'll push a little bit longer, and then make sure that you're on your way over there. You don't think that yeah, yeah, it's probably not group, worth. We're gonna go for the grouper. Don't go. We'll get the grouper later on. How late? How long are you gonna fish till? Two minutes. Two. No, Half an hour. All right, these guys hooked it up on the water launch. Fresh yellowtail. Then we're gonna fish for the group. They're gonna fish for the grouper to end it. Then I gotta make it back. It's getting a little bit sketchy. Woo! Never had lunch like that before. Tied up on the side. Oh man. I think he just hooked one. Did you hook one? Oh. It looked like something hit it right when you got it down. I'm not, I'm not liking this wind. I'm going to start to make my way back. All right. All right, safely. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, guys. Yeah, I have my radio on. I'm on my, on uh, eight. I'll let you know, you know. Back to shore. Yeah, when I get, I'll let you know when I'm back to shore or if anything happens. But thank you guys for everything. Okay. I'm going to leave tomorrow. Thank you guys for everything. It's been a pleasure. See you later. Yeah. Good guys. All right, I'm going to get back. I'm not liking this wind. All good. They may be hoping they get the group on here. Dude. Kima jig doing work, still marking stuff. Got him. Oh, nice. Oh, that was a snapper. Got him. Yeah. Right here, a little drift. Seems like there's more marks down there. Got him. 
trigger a big one. That's the size that I want. Nope. Of course. A lot of triggers right here. fish those teeth what's up mr. trigger pull the trigger something like that I think I'm just gonna troll my way back might as well cast a couple more times here against the cliffs get to the end of the point here. Still seeing a lot of marks down below. Memberships, Amazon storefront, all that good stuff. So hard back. some trigger fish and some uh that uh I got those little two all right got all the fish on nice salt water brine here waiting to go back pack it up tomorrow head home Okay, here we go with the fish on the brine. Look at 
Bria. Snapper. Bigger fish. Yeah, yeah, you want to know how to do it. Yellow tail. Somewhere in here. Yeah. Yellow tail. Let's go get these tire miles played up. There it is. Traeger smoked yellowtail from the Sea of Cortez. Put it in a brine of coconut aminos, honey, chili garlic for about three hours, four hours, and then put it in front of the fan, half hour each side to form the pellicle skin. Threw it on the Traeger smoker at about 200 for about an hour. And it came out amazing. Got the finish up the collars on there and the belly. And then next up is Loretto, more Baja. Thank you all for watching. Living the dream, one love.